Hi guys, so today we're reading uh, on the book Impressionism 13 Artists Children Should Know. Today we're reading Beth Morisot. She is a woman artist, so let's start reading about her. Born January 14, 1841 in Bourget. Died in March 2nd, 1895 in Paris. Berthe Morisot was married to the brother of Edouard Monet. Monet. They had two daughters together. That's interesting. Five or six crazy people, one of them a woman, exhibited their paintings. Here's what a newspaper reported in 1874 about Impressionist first exhibition in Paris. One of these mad people was Berthe Morisot. In Paris of those days, many daughters of well-to-do families learned to play musical instruments and to draw and paint a little. These women often used their artistic skills to create family portraits. Nowadays, we would simply use a camera. Berth Morisot and her sister Edma had private painting lessons because in the 19th century, young ladies were not permitted to attend the art academy. Their tutor was a very famous painter named Camille Corot. He immediately saw that Berth and Edma were very talented. Corot told their parents, with the character your daughters have, my lessons will be geared to make them into artists and not into uniportant cable amateurs. Do you understand what this means in your world? It's a revolution, but I venture to say that it is a catastrophe. Berth Morisot, Butterfly Hunt. 1874, Musée d'Orsay in Paris. In those days, people wore elaborate dresses and hats even when they were chasing classical butterflies. A few nice brush strokes were all Beth needed to show the, the little girls and the blossoms. So, it's this picture I read you about, about the butterfly hunt. I think it looks beautiful, really uh, good art work. Berth Morisot, Hanging the Laundry Out to Dry, 1875, National Gallery, Washington. Berth preferred to paint landscapes and families with their children. These subjects were used often by amateur women para artists in Paris, but Morisot landscapes and portraits were much more modern looking. So this is the picture I just now talked about here. As you can see, I think it's a pretty good name for this kind of art. It certainly was not a catastrophe, but it was definitely very unusual. Both women were successfully and set up their own studio. Emma got married in 1986-1869 and stopped painting. But birth continued, and what a sensation she became. She got to know Edouard de Manet, and he became especially enthusiastic about his art. Berth was very pretty, and Manet painted her again and again. His aim was to paint her in a very modern way, and she perhaps not as respectably as how she had learned at home, Berth later befriended the Impressionist as well. She soon became one of the crazy people herself. Right at the front of this book, you'll see a picture that Edward Monet painted of Berth. It's called Balcony. Let's go to the beginning of the book and see if that's true. New beginning. Somewhere here. Oh my gosh, it's true. Look at it. This is her. Or I can, this one. Let's go back to 
our <clears throat> so this was the uh, chapter or the artist about we read today tomorrow we're reading Camille Pizarro um, he's all but he's men um, so hope you enjoyed today see you soon bye